It was an uncontrollable need I had to help her. I knew it would eventually break me, but I continued to be there for her despite this knowledge. Slowly, this need became a nag in my backbone. It hurt. She somehow attached a string to it that pulled me backwards towards her. I was afraid of this pull, afraid that it would break my backbone because as time went on, the pull became more jarring, sending pain throughout my entire body. The string brought me to her feet, where I allowed her to transfer all of her pain into me. Over time, the string became a hook that tied me to her. I let her transfer every small fracture that her mind created into me. I was a holding space, until she wanted these issues back. I held them for her, treated them with care, tried to mend them, but usually came up empty-handed. I continued to be her holding space for months. I continued to let her yank on the string and empty her problems into me. Like her, I was beginning to break from the weight of them. I had to detach the string, for I needed a break. I needed my backbone to heal for a bit. A few months later, my phone rang. When the news came through the receiver, I felt as if I needed her string back. I wanted it back. I needed it. I would do anything to be her holding space again. For being her holding space was better than feeling guilty. I wanted the string. I wanted the pain. I wanted it all. For what she did appeared to be a product of my fear. I'd been afraid of being her backbone and in turn. She tried to kill herself.